welcome back to Leave the Sunshine. So today we are making an every plate meal that you've seen in one of our episodes. Arky pastricha pork chop. Okay, Go let's pause right there. That was that was cute. These are apricot sriracha <laughs> pork chops. So you tell them what you're gonna what you're gonna do, what we're gonna make, and I'll go ahead and start getting some of the things out of the cat. So our first episode, our um, first thing is we need ginger. Do you want to show them the ginger? Do you know which one the ginger is? Yeah. So that's the ginger right there. Right here. This is the ginger. Let me show Dropping knives. So let me, let me show you. So basically, it's right there. This the ginger. So next is the minion rice, which is right here. So since it has the words on it, it has just minion um rice. <laughs> Sorry, I just wanted to wear my other glasses in this episode. See, Jasmine. I feel like they named it after a Disney princess. So we got our ginger. Basically, it's like a rock. <laughs> Looks like a rock a little bit. Okay. So can you tell me? Um. And then we got the pork chop. Yep. So. What does that first say? Um, preheat oven um, to four, 425 degrees. Okay, so I'll Wash the oven. and dry. Peel. Finely chopped ginger. So let's. And it says wash and dry produce. So take the carrots, wash them off, and the ginger, rinse them off, and then get a paper towel to dry them off. Yeah. One of the things I'm surprised what it hasn't told you all is that as you can see from our previous videos where we did cooking episodes, we're in a different kitchen. So we are officially in our new house. <laughs> we've been here for about two and a half months. Um, we've been doing a lot of changes around the house. Here, take all the carrots and rinse them all at once. With, rinse them all together. And then rinse the ginger off too so I can chop that up. I gotta also get us a saucepan. You got what you did made it right? Yeah, <laughs> so that's what we'll do. So, Yep, put the carrots right there. Don't get the recipe wet. So we are going to peel and chop the ginger, and then we're gonna put some. Oil. We're gonna peel it together because I don't want you to peel too much because we might need that for another recipe. So we don't want to waste the garlic. Okay, so um, there's like some little Chinese sauces. Uh, Chinese sauce? How about we say Asian sauces? Yeah, Asian sausage. So we have soy sauce and Togu Astracha sauce. <laughs> you trying to say the brand? Yes. That's cute. Sriracha. It's Sriracha chili sauce. So maybe Asian people use this in their chili. Or it's for Asian cuisine and anyone in different cultures can use it to spice up a little bit. Uh-huh, and food. I want you to see behind the, uh, the green little thing. See? It looks like my hair. <laughs> right, Mommy? The back end looks black.
like um better than the last nine. Fine. But that was at our old house, so I kind of miss. So what am I doing? What's the next thing we gotta do? Um, the next thing on it is when the pork chops are done. Just to make the what? Did you just a little with oil? I have chop? to make the sauce. So we're on step five. five. He would drizzle of oil, so pan over the dough we add our garlic. See? That's how we save the garlic. Yeah. So, pork chops are here. Garlic so, is here. So, we did add garlic, main chopped ginger. Mm -hmm. We don't have any ginger. Yeah, I, I forgot and put all the ginger in the rice. It'll be all right. We should have read step six before we did that. Well, we probably should have read all of it, but here we are. Gotta run the dishwasher again. Yeah. Well, not right now. Wait, we'll wait till we're done after we're eating dinner. Okay, so what do I do? I've got the garlic in the pan. Then what do I do? After that, you cook until fragment. Thirty fragrant. seconds. Fragrant. Fragrant. At 30 seconds, add jam, soy sauce, and one and a half cup of water. One, one. wait a second, it has one dash four. So one and one fourth? Yeah, one and one fourth. Cup of water, so I and put then, the water in there. Can you bring me the sriracha, the soy sauce, and the water? You like the way the garlic, come smell the garlic. You see, that's what it means, it smells, it smells fragrant. You smell it? Okay, it's just, well, I told you there was water in it, but it's just water, so. It's okay, it's just water. Get a paper towel and brown floor. Alexa, stop. So, so as you can hear, the timer just went off, so it's time to get the carrots out of the oven. And if the um, fire thing goes off. What next? Get Captain Park out. Watch out. So as you can see, carrots are done. James being made. And then we'll put our pork chops once the sauce thickens, I will get our plate. Did you need to go get the sauce for the pork chop? I already did it. Um, so we got our two plates. So basically, um, somebody bought this for our mom, my mom. Our cousin, Tamika. Can you close those cabinets? Like, who's Tamika? Our cousin, uh, uh, my Uncle Baba's daughter. Can you close the cabinets? So I'm gonna did go ahead and put the pork me? chops in the pan. Mom, did she remember me? You should ask her in the video and then see if she responds. Um, what's your name? Cousin Tamika. Um, cousin Tamika, um, if you remember me, I'm Lennington. I go to second grade that and um, Okay, you, you gonna take it away for us? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, I'll just wait. 
God is good. We need to thank him for our food. Now we are back to do it in your church. Amen. All right. Do you want me to cut a piece of your, your pork chop for you? Yes. About your arm. You need to get a piece of out in it. Yep. Lemonade tonight. Compliments of Aunt Linda. dinner we know what lemonade tastes like um actually the pork chops are good you like the sauce mm -hmm. really mm -hmm. welcome back to living the sunshine so we're outside taking a nice afternoon walk evening because we just ate dinner <laughs> yeah so we can at least enjoy like our tummies to rest and other stuff. She wanted to do a video of our walk. Why? I don't know. What do you guys say, Boo? So why? Because I just wanted to um so our beds can rest like faster. Um we can do stuff. Ooh, mom, look what's on that tree different plants and bushes and stuff awesome. so um this is something that i've been wanting to do is making sure that we're cooking dinner earlier eating earlier so that way at least right now while it's end of summer fall is about to start we can still enjoy some daylight hours especially because it's not hot outside it's not cold outside is that how you run for real <laughs> Um, Mom, but I, I mean, you were like 10 feet behind me. You'd be all right. So ensuring that we're getting some exercise in and some walking. And this is definitely not something that she can do or, oh, you know, Mama, she could do by herself. Is the yeah. Hello. Speaking to the neighbors, cause this is a friendly neighborhood folks, people, like speak to you, they say hello. They, you know, when we first moved in, um, Lennox on this side of me, you know that. Um, when we first, walk over here. When we first moved in, people brought us uh, cas not casseroles, uh, cupcakes. So as you can see, this is a very, I wouldn't say busy, but busy street. I guess that is the right word to say, certain parts of the day. Um, even if uh, Lennox were to ride the school bus to school, she would, ha she would have to walk this path. You mean somebody's jogging in the neighborhood? Like that's totally fine. But as you can see, there's no sidewalks in this street and she would have to do this walk by herself to get to the school bus, which is not gonna happen on my watch. So we're just checking in. We'll check in with you all in a little bit. So we are still on our walk. Anything you want to say? Um, I just want to say my, my belly's actually resting good. And it actually will help me get um more taller. How is, okay, help me explain, explain that to me. How is walking going to help you get more tall or taller? I'm right by your shoulder, mommy. And okay, but what does walking have to do with that? Walking means you get some exercise and um, you get a little protein in your body when you eat. So, yeah. I don't know how she came up with that because for me, that one plus one ain't equaling two. But you know what? It ain't got to make sense to me. It just has to make sense to her. So, okay, so you wanted to do a video while we're walking. Is there anything you want to talk about? Um, so this neighborhood is really, really working hard. Like some police live here in this neighborhood. She, because I see a police car. You sound like you out of breath. I am. Like you walking hard. We're not even walking that fast. Ooh, 
You okay? Tripped over them big feet. No, I tripped over this crack. I also made cracks in ropes. <laughs> it just is. So, we've never been down this road before. Um, I think I've uh, driven I, down this road. I, I think I don't want to go up the hill. It'll be all right. Please. You need to get this exercise in. We're just doing that's a, husky, a walking circle. No, that's a gentleman's shepherd. They bite, don't they? Any dog will bite, whether it's small or big. Medium. Medium is a size. But yeah, you, see, you all see how long we've been walking. And that corner right there where you see that stop sign is if she was riding the bus to school, that would be where her bus stop is. And it's, in my opinion, that, that is... That would be my bus stop last year. No, it would be your bus stop right now. But like I said, in my opinion, I feel like that's too far, especially since you all have seen since we've been walking um, how busy the road is. But again... We've never walked down this road. Our road is one of the main roads in and out of the neighborhood. That is a pretty wreath on their door. I do like how their storm door is the same color as their front door. I showed you all, um, yeah, I think back in July like or walkway. early August on Facebook that I painted our front door that coral color and I'd been debating whether or not to paint the storm door the same color. And I think seeing that black storm door with their black front door well, and how it all, well, we're not gonna take a picture of that and put it on our YouTube channel. That's not appropriate. But seeing them together really just solidified for me that I think I'm gonna go ahead and do it. Oh, you gotta stop. I don't have to stop, I can see you. You coming? You can catch up. The, so this storm door right here, their house is like beige with brown shutters. And their front door is white. And their storm door is beige. So the storm door is matching the color of the vinyl. Not sure I would have done that. But hey, to each his own. Seeing some different houses. Ooh, what I will mama. say, this walk has... Yeah, they're they're gravel driveway looks nice right that's what i hope ours will look like when we're done when we get some more gravel I delivered like our neighbors hers is actually pretty yeah so we got well, it's not a competition that's right it's not a competition because we each will have our homes look the way we want them to look in our own time right yes mom if we paint the stairs can i choose the color um I will give you choices to choose from, and you can choose from the choices that I give you. Is that good? Okay, that's good. Okay. That's that's a cool, um, cool agreement, and we'll probably keep take y'all along for the walk, or not the walk, the ride that will be painting our stairs. We have to paint the front porch as that was replaced when. I bought the house and then I had the back deck torn down and had stairs built out but we have to let the wood dry and because it's been rainy in a while probably won't be able to do that until maybe the first of next next month now that is nice they have their stairs and railing painted a dark their blue color to match the um surrounding of their windows never thought about doing that you do it but that's the unique hey, mommy, i like you that do it inside the house inside and outside well we're not gonna oh my god i'm a cat are you scared of a cat no okay i'm never even scared of a cat you mean now you aren't scared of cats no i'm not i said now you aren't Okay, can we turn around and go back home? Well, we're walking in one big circle, so we'll make this right up here. No, this left. 
No, if we make a left, we're going to be walking further away from home. You want to go walk further or you want to no, go home? We're, going back. we're not making a U turn, we're making this right up here. But that's the easy, that's the fast way to get home. It's not necessarily a fast way, but it's a nice. Ooh, mom, I like their colored door. Yeah, that's a pretty colored door. In the fence. Oh, in the front yard? Yeah. Yeah. I can see why they do. They probably have a dog that they let come out in the front yard. And so that they, we don't, they don't come into the street. But yeah, that's and a nice front die. yard. Well, why would you say that? Because every time when a dog goes in the street and a car doesn't see it, that you, oh, just like that story where um Honey ran out the door while um Mommy was going out to tell me something. And, and there's like a car coming and Honey like ran super fast and was like, oh, Honey Bunny, what? You almost got crashed by a car, you saved, you saved me though. You said she saved you? Nope. Or <laughs> she ran fast enough to not get hit by the car? She ran fast enough to save me. No, to love me. Okay, but say, what was she saving you from? Because you were playing with your friends. No, she just missed me. That's why. And that's why we don't have a dog now. Because she kept on sleeping and being in the house. Well, it was more than that, but that uh, that is part of the reason. And you and I don't think that's a, that was the best decision. Oh, now you're saying it wasn't the best decision because a couple, two weeks last week you were saying it was the best decision that I was right. Yeah, but now I'm changing my mind. I miss her. Well, I mean. Even if it was the best decision, that means you can still miss her. No one's saying you, you can't miss her. Mom, she was the only puppy we had. I like that pea gravel, too. So tiny rocks. Yeah, it's called pea gravel. What? Pea gravel? P-E-A. Is this the fast way to get home? It is a way to get home. We stop. Look and watch. Ready yet? Mom, get set. It's all that. That car is like a third of the mile away. Y'all can't even see that car. There she's talking about. Yeah. Come on. You still need to stay on this side of the street. Over here. Oh. Stay over here. There's the car she was talking about so far away. But stay over in there. Stay over here in the gravel. Lennox, the whole thing when you're walking in a main street is to look ahead. Stop turning around because every time you turn around and look back, you almost trip and fall. Right? No. Sometimes. Lennox, you almost just tripped and fell twice looking back at those three cars. What else would you like to talk about on our walk? Um, maybe just the fast way to get home. I'm not sure, but we'll see. Let's see. And basically, um, Ooh, my look. Look at the door. Yeah, it's black on black. They just sold that house. Somebody? Are you walking where you should be walking? Because no. I can't see you in the camp. Wait a second, Mom. Somebody owns that house? Yes, yeah, somebody owns every one of these houses around here. But there's a new person that's going to be moving into that house because they just sold it. How did you know that? Because it had a for sale sign in the front yard. <laughs> Remember, we would drive by the house and I was like, look, the house is for sale. Why didn't we get it, though? Because it came for sale after we already bought our house. That's why. That's why what? Options. 
you want. Gravel. Can wait till you... Linux, what did I just say? So we get sprinklers? No, look dogs. forward. You're not supposed to be turning back because again, you almost just fell. You'll see what see what they are when they drive by. We're gonna end our video now. We're back home. Someone has to get ready for bath time, well, shower and bedtime because it is a school night. Any final words you want to say before we go in the house? Um, is that I get my test results um, tomorrow because I did a test on Thursday, and um, if I get an A plus, I will tell you guys tomorrow after the end of school well i don't know if we're going to record tomorrow after school but we'll let y'all know how she does on that test we're going to record a short video that's only one minute so bye see y'all in the next video bah, 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 bah.